we're recording. Hey there YouTube, my name's Kirby as Boss, welcome to my channel, welcome to my messy room. And today, I am going to teach you how to do the look on the Naked Palette 3. Bet you were probably expecting a skit or something, and honestly I would have made one. But like I said, I've been very busy with the musical and everything, and a lot of people have been asking me about doing the Naked Palette 3 since I have it, and I've been doing a lot of my makeup with that. So, let's do it! So, once you've done your liquid eyeliner above the lash line, then you're going to take your Naked Palette 3 and get started. First, all in the brow bone, we're going to use Strange, because I was a little strange. Next, what you're going to do is you are going to take, right here, it's called Limit, it's the fourth one. You're going to take that and you're going to put that all across your lid. And I apologize that you guys have to be this close to my face because people probably shouldn't be this close to anyone's face unless you're giving them CPR. Bow, 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 bow. I've been feeling down. Bye, bye. If you don't like musicals, then what are you? You know what I mean? Alright, so now you have your lid done. What you're gonna do next is you are going to take Factory. It is this brown one right here. You're going to take it and you are going to put it on the outer V. Oh, it's like already dark. What? Anyways, you're going to do that. Oh, you want it enough so you can highlight your eyes. It makes your eyes pop if there's a darker color behind it. Alright, there you go. So that's what that is looking like so far. You can probably see better with this eye. Let me see if I can focus it. There. Ta-da! Okay, so next what you're gonna do is the crease of the eye. So you are going to take, oh my gosh, I'm way too close to this camera. <laughs> okay, so next what you're going to take is, it's called Nooner. It's right next to the gold one, this one. Nooner. Nooner. You're gonna take Nooner. And you're gonna go along the crease, and I always overlap it onto this. But I don't do that with everything, but this is an exception because these colors are pretty closely related to each other And I think it makes it look darker anyways, so and it helps blend it at the same time So I mean, You get three benefits in one. Three in one And there you go, okay, so we're almost done with our look So now it's time for mess by the way, the liquid eyeliner I used is liquid eyeliner from, from Sephora, but it's just liquid eyeliner. The way that it looks is it looks like this, but yeah, basically this is what the brush looks like. It's very like, I don't want to say flimsy, but it can move. You know what I mean. Quick tip, does your mascara ever run out on you like that? Well, what you can do is you can take eye drops and put a few drops in and then mix it together and then it's like brand new. So, there you go. Save you some money. So you're going to apply to the top lashes and the lower lashes. And then here you go. It ends up looking like this. You get the top lashes and your bottom lashes. And yeah. So now we have to move on to the blush. <laughs> now recently I got this CoverGirl one. And what it is, is it's three different colors. One, two, three. So yeah, I just applied my blush. What you're going to do is first you're going to take the highlighting color and you're going to take your brush. I'm just gonna like redo it for you because that looks really bad. <laughs> Sorry, I'm used to doing my stage makeup so like it's very, 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 you know, seen. Okay, but what you do is you take your highlighting and you go right there, just a little bit above the cheekbone, below the lash the lash, the eye. Then you're going to take the middle color and you're just going to apply it normally. But not crazy like I'm doing because I'm insane. Lastly, you're going to take this. I think it's the contour. I don't know these terms. I looked this up on Google. You're going to take that and just go underneath. It's going to go underneath. And this is supposedly supposed to give you some cheekbones, so we're gonna see. 
If Mama gets some really nice cheekbones out of this. And it kind of works. I actually like this. I like this a lot. Looks really nice. I did it a little too much. I'm sure if I get some practice, it'll look a lot better. I just use lip liner. I don't know. I just don't really use lipstick. And what this is, this is Revlon Color Stay. And this color is uh, blush. Or rose fard. Can you see that? Rose fard? I'm sorry, why would you name something rose fard? That's my question. You see that? Look at that. Rose fard. Yeah, I'm just wearing some rose fard on my lips. You know. Is it like the same color as my lips, but I just do it because it's just a tiny bit brighter and it makes it more noticeable. And yeah, brighter. And I'm sure now you can probably see it. See, it's a little bit brighter than my top lip. I like these a lot better than lipstick because I feel like it stays on longer. I feel like it, this doesn't smear as bad as lipstick can. And then usually after that what I do is I take some lip gloss. This one is from Bath and Body Works. It's, I love gossip, but I know they don't make this, anymore, this one anymore. It's just like a light pink. And I just, a little squeeze. It's almost like a clear color with a little bit of pink. Put that on and then ta-da. So this is your final look. You have your, da -da -da, let me focus. You have your mascara done, you have your lashes and this done. See, it's like not necessarily barely noticeable, but it's very nude. Uh, lips done, your cheeks done. And yeah. Thank you for watching this video. Remember to comment, rate, subscribe, like up the video. Comment down below if you want me to do any more tutorials, if you have any video ideas. And also comment down below if you want me to open a P.O. box because I've been considering doing that because a bunch of you guys are like, I want to send you Panera gift cards. I want to send you Chick-fil-A gift cards. I want to send you bracelets. I want to write you a letter. Da -da 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 -da. And I think that'd just be a better way for us to connect because then I could do, uh, you know, a review or like, you know, do a mailbox video and all that fun stuff. And I would actually really like to do that. I think that'd be really fun. Remember to keep on keeping on and I'll catch you on the flip side.